Hey guys, my name is Steve, and today we're going to show you how to install Mac OS X on VMware. Now, there are two reasons why I would choose VMware instead of VirtualBox. The first reason is when you want to resize the resolution display on VMware would be much faster and easier than VirtualBox. Uh, I remember on VirtualBox, you have to edit the Apple uh, playlist. But on VMware, with just a VMware tool, everything is now under control. So, in this video, I'm going to show you how to install Mac OS X with a VMDX file, which is also a virtual machine disk. Now, it's going to be applied for every single version of Mac OS X from Mac OS X Lion all the way to the latest El Capitan. Now, uh, each version of Mac OS X will be in a VMDX file, uh, which in a torrent that uh, I will supply you in the description below. Um, there, there are some reasons uh, why I have to use torrent file. Uh, but I'm not going to uh, explain. So anyway, let's get started. Okay guys, so uh, the first thing you need to do uh, is uh, download the uh, VMDX file of uh, Mac OS X that I supply in the description below. Uh, but I would use Mac OS X Mavericks as an example. So after you download it, uh, you should uh, see uh, the uh, Mac OS X Maverick right here. And uh, see this file. Uh, this is in 7z uh, extension. Uh, all you do is uh, you can extract here. Uh, you can extract it with uh, 7zip or WinRAW. And um, I, I but uh, I have extract already, so I have to skip. So the next thing uh, is uh, lock, go to OS X Mavericks uh, folder. Uh, and then go to VMware Unlocker Mac OS X Guest. And then uh, go to VMware 8, 9, 10 series. And then uh, go to VMware Workstation. Or you have uh, Fusion, you can go, go ahead and that. And uh, go to Launch Windows. And uh, in the Install CMD, uh, you need to right click and run the administrator. So we need to uh, uh, tap this process. To have. So, after you have done, you need to go to VMware Workstation, right here. So, uh, you launch VMware Workstation, right here. I will send this to VMware Workstation 12. Uh, the next thing is, uh, you don't have any virtual machine, but uh, we choose open a virtual machine. And then uh, you go to OS X, uh, just start earlier, uh, OS X folder, OS X Mavericks folder, and you should see a VMX file um, here, which is uh, VMX. Uh, next, you open up this file. Okay, and then the next step is to edit the virtual machine settings. The next thing, uh, uh, first, head up to option first. So the um, uh, the version of Mac OS X, you can uh, edit this name. I will name it OS X, and the version uh, you should take it the OS X uh, Server 1006. Um, it's it's 1009, but uh, just look at that. And uh, let's share a folder. Like that. Go ahead and go hardware, uh, and uh, you should change to four gigabyte of RAM maximum. Um, I four gigabyte is recommend. Uh, processor make it twelve, make it two, make it two. Uh, hard disk one fifty gigabyte. Uh, go to CD, DVD, SCSI. Uh, so use. Uh, it's nothing. Now go adapter. Now this is important to you. Uh, you need to enable bridge and enable replicate physical network uh, connected state. 
to uh, attack your uh, network uh, driver like that then this one you show all USB input and you should be able to uh, no. okay so next go ahead and play the virtual machine Check a while. It's a uh, move. Okay, so lots of VM well. Okay, so well we should uh, get a full screen right now. A little bit okay. Okay, so uh, after you boot up your lock screen, like here, uh, you don't have to install anything. It's uh, when you boot up to a welcome screen. It's like you have installed already. Okay, so after you just the United States, continue. Choose a keyboard layout, the US keyboard. And uh, how you connect, you choose a local network. So next, uh, you do is uh, in the CCB IP connection type, you need to uh, Choose using DHCP and continue. Let's have a network for you. A little bit there. Okay, so um, we're back and um, okay, so we continue the process. Uh, you need to do is uh, using the SP and in DNS server, you need to type in 8.8.8.8 and then go ahead and continue. I want to start your network for you. It's just a little bit bug. I, I didn't remember the process for you. I continue. Okay. Okay, so uh you want to do some Mac, you need to uh don't you have to now or you can jump on Windows PC. This is kind of this but this uh you know just like this one. Continue then uh, agree agree and create a computer account. Let me type my that oh yes, yes there you go gonna create a crown for you and you should set up your Mac and uh, just a little bit and it would put up your hot home screen Okay, so we had put up to the home screen. 
C it's way for the dock and um, I successfully put up your home screen and you see a whole system here okay so next uh, go ahead and shrink down please and the next thing is uh, go to player and uh, head to remove all device go to CD DVD SCSI and head your settings next thing is uh, you need to go to the used ASO image file and browse so you gotta head down OS 10 go to OS guest uh, VMware 8910 series tools and you see a Darwin ISO and go ahead and open up okay okay a little bit uh, a little again so um, go ahead and go to settings and um, use check connected, okay? Check connected, okay? Okay, so after uh, you uh, do that, it, it will appear a window called VMware Tools. And go ahead and install VMware Tool right now. So go ahead and continue. Macintosh, continue, install. Set your password, continue installation, and wait for it to install the software. Okay, so uh, after it's successful, uh, take quite long, okay? Okay, so after it was successful, uh, in, uh, just completely installing, you need to restart your, start your computer, start a virtual machine. Okay, so it boot up to uh, Mac OS X Mavericks, 
and um, after boot up you see something really special after just a little bit after boot up I will show you now something very special okay so Okay, so after you put up, again you go full screen and you see this in special. And now you can see, um, what I do about this Mac, and you see, we got a RAM, Macintosh. Okay, so. Okay, so you thank you for watching, and um, uh, uh, sorry for some mistake I just uh, made earlier. Uh, I, I would get into, I uh, would get used to a uh, couple of days, and um, if you have some more question want to ask, uh, uh, just uh, comment at the description below, and if you have more question or want more suggestion about video, uh, uh, you should you uh, you would uh, comment either at the description down below, and I see you guys to the next video.